Hi, Claire. I'm Katie. So nice to meet you. I'm such a fan of the show, but you have all these boys just chasing after you. Oh, you really do on the show. So what can you sort of tease our fans about what's going on with you and Gunner, maybe? Well, steamy kiss. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> we have the most brilliant writer in the world writing for us. Callie Corey is just, she's a legend in herself. So you should expect the unexpected. She writes human beings okay. like human beings. She's just amazing. Um, and life is so unpredictable and thusly. This show is just gonna, it's gonna blow your mind. There's so much coming. What about the prospect of you ever taking poor Avery back? I don't know. I mean, everybody thinks he's such a rat bag, but he's not actually. He's just, uh, he's just lost right now. But uh, people get found, so you'll see. Could you maybe possibly help him? I think she's helped him enough. Enough? Okay. But you know, she might get a second win. Yeah, absolutely. And sort of talk to us about your character with Gunner signing on to Reina's record label. What will happen with that? Well, uh, you don't know. I don't know. There's a, we've got a sneak peek this afternoon, and then um, there is just there is so much more coming. The episodes we, we get them in the mornings, and it, it's just we we all turn around to each other and go, "This is just getting better and better." And I'm like, "What do I have to do this week?" It's it's so much fun. So uh, we've got some good stuff coming. Is there a possibility that we will see you guys join the tour? The Juliet and Reina tour. You never know, anything could happen. It's Music City. Okay, and then I just heard that Chris Carmack has been cast on the show. Will he be working with your character at all? He might be. He's a very, very nice boy. Does that mean you'll have three boys to sort of fend off? Maybe. Maybe. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Lucky girlie. Thank you so much. Congratulations with everything. You too.